Say Benny, did you know that we watched the Super Mario Brothers movie on Affix TV? Yes, we did know that we watched the Super Mario Brothers movie on Affix TV because it's one of our favorite Nintendo movies. I agree, Benny. We always loved watching the Super Mario Brothers movie because it's very based. Well, I'm doing a skipping rope because I need to do more exercise. Also, I'm currently at 28 times that I skipped and jumped on the rope. I hope I can jump on the rope 100 times in a row to improve my skills. Hey Sub, can I join you to skip on the rope? Sure thing, ism. Go ahead and give it a try, I guess. Okay thanks. I'm pretty sure that it will be fun to play skipping rope. Whoa. This is fun, isn't it? Yeah, of course it is fun because I'm improving my muscles for playing skipping rope. Ness, what song are you listening to? I'm listening to Peaches by Jack Black because it's one of the funniest the Super Mario Bros. movie songs with my headphones. I concur. So, can I sit with you for my conversation? Yes you can, Abel. You can sit with me for your conversation. So tell me, Ness, have you ever noticed that Princess Peach Showtime was released two days ago? Not really, but I'm not sure why. Well, it's because Princess Peach Showtime is based on Super Princess Peach. Right, Ness? Yay, I guess so. Would you look at that, Pearl and Layla? I see some clouds in the sky. I see those, Eleanor. Oh look. The cloud shape looks like Princess Peach. It's so pretty, isn't it? Of course it is. The cloud shape of Princess Peach is so beautiful. Agnes, you are so dumb and weak. Hey, why would you slap me? Well, yes Vasta, this is what you deserve for calling me dumb and weak even though I'm not dumb and weak. Good try, Agnes. I punched you because you slapped me. Oh, do you really think that you would fight with me? Okay then, bring it on. Fine. If you say so. Agnes, yes faster, stop fighting both of you. And yes faster, leave Agnes alone because she doesn't want to fight with you again. You're stupid. Well, you pay for this, Agnes. I wasn't expecting that Yes Vasta would stop fighting with me when Dis resists Yes Vasta from fighting with me for the argument. Right, Dis? Right. Also, Agnes, please do not fight with Yes Vasta again because I don't like how people fight in an argument, okay? Okay, I get it. Let me guess, not, isn't that Yes Vasta is dumb? I know. Also, Tree, Yes Vasta is even dumber than Mal. Oh great. Not you again, miss. Try and not, do you really think that my friend Mal is dumber than Yes Vasta? Well, of course she isn't. Also, both of you are stupid for thinking that Mal is dumber than Yes Vasta. Miss, that was very rude of you to say that to me and Tree. Also, we're not stupid. You are. I agree with you, not. You are just being stupid as Mal. No I'm not, you idiot. Get out of our sight or we will kick your butt for calling us idiot. Screw you not and try. You are definitely gonna regret it. Well, run away, loser. So, stay mad, miss. Yes. I won the game. Sorry Ashley Perez. But you lost the game because you're in the last place. Please do better luck next time. C'est bon, Lee. Je suis presque sûr que j'aurai plus de chance la prochaine fois grâce à certains matchs que j'ai parfois perdu ou gagné. I agree with you, Lee and Ashley Perez. Well, at least I got the second place on this game. Not bad for me. Me too. Also, I'm at the third place. Getting close to losing the game. Well, Ashley Perez. Eloise, and Zazwisa, let's play the game again.
Look at that, Derek. I'm watching Mickey's Mouse Trap Trailer because the Disney horror movie is the scariest and best. Wow. That movie was pretty awesome and scary. It's even scarier than Winnie the Pooh's Blood and Honey. So, let me watch it if I can. Oh look. Derek and Stephanie are watching Mickey's Mouse Trap. I'm pretty sure that will be a cool horror movie. Hey Mel, check this movie out on Stephanie's phone. I'm really sure you like it. Anyway, can you join me and Stephanie to watch Mickey's Mouse Trap on her phone? No thanks, because I'm good. Oh, okay. Well, I'm just gonna have some fun with troublemaking stuff. Hey Free, Mid, and Abel, I have a question for three of you. What's your favorite object show? My favorite object show is Battle for Dream Island by Jack and Jellify because it's one of the most famous object shows we ever heard. My favorite object show is Inanimate Insanity by Animation Epic because it's one of the most based on Battle for Dream Island. And my favorite object show is Battle for BFDI because it's one of the greatest BFDI seasons we ever existed. So Est, let me ask you a question. What's your favorite object show? For me? My favorite object show is Extraordinarily Excellent Entities by Webs for Abs because it's the best sequel of Excellent Entities. Alfred, what is Sastro doing? She's lifting dumbbells because she's doing more gyms. So tell me, Sastro, why are you lifting dumbbells? Carson and Alfred, it's because I'm doing gyms to make me feel strong and I'm a muscular girl for lifting dumbbells. That's why. Greetings everyone. Um, who are you anyway? I'm Magic Dust Wonder Perez, the host. And I'm Magic Dust's female self, Fanastasia Wonder Perez, the co-host. And this is the Awesomeness Elimination Series. Okay, I have a quick question for you. What is the Awesomeness Elimination Series? Well, the Awesomeness Elimination Series is my character elimination because there are 30 contestants to participate in the Awesomeness Elimination Series. Also, only one winner can win the grand prize in the Awesomeness Elimination Series. Alright, now what is the grand prize? You will find out once the finale is over. By the way, losing contestants will be up for elimination when they're losing the contest and anyone gets eliminated from my character elimination if whoever gets the most votes. Plus, please come with me and my female self Anastasia the co-host because I have prepared my first contest and all of you are gonna start the first contest. Well, okay then. So, Sashtaro and Carson, let's go to participate in the first contest. Now what is the first contest? Glad you asked, Re. The first contest is climbing the ladder and walking the castle wall. Now here's how the contest works, you must climb up the ladder to get on the castle wall. If you get on the castle wall, you must walk on it to get to the last ladder to finish. Whoever climbs down the ladder will become two team captains. If you fall off the castle wall, then don't worry, it won't hurt you because the height is short and the ground grass is comfortable, but you will have to start over again. But remember, do not ever climb the fence of exit blockage to get to the finish because that will be cheating. If you do, then you will be teleported back to the beginning. Anyway, are 30 of you ready to begin the contest? Yes, we're ready to begin. Well, I'm glad that 30 of you are ready. So, we will teleport ourselves to finish because we're waiting for you to finish and win. Ready? Get set. Start. Alright everybody, let's climb up the ladder, walk on the castle wall, and climb down the ladder to finish and win. But no climbing the fence of eggs and blockage because it will be cheating. Ugh. Seriously, I hate this contest because it sucks so hard. Mal, that was very insensitive of the contest. 
but don't you even think about cheating on this contest by climbing on the fence of exit blockage or else the host will teleport back to the beginning if you climb on it. So, start climbing already because they're about to start climbing. Now look, anyone is climbing up the ladder. Yes. I made it on the castle wall. Now let's walk onto the castle wall to get to the climb down ladder, but the climb down ladder is far away from me. So, let's get walking. No way. I'm not climbing up this stinky ladder because it really sucks. Miz, do you seriously want to lose the contest? Everyone has started the contest because they're climbing up the ladder and walking onto the castle wall, except you and Mal. If you don't want to lose, then do the contest already. Yep. I agree with you, Ben. Miss, you better do the contest already or yes, two leading contestants are about to reach the finish landing by climbing down the ladder. Me too. And don't you even think about cheating on the contest by climbing up the fence of exit blockage or else the host will teleport back to the beginning. Okay fine. I will climb up the ladder to get to the stinkiest longest castle wall. Okay Dissonism, let's climb up the ladder to get onto the castle wall. Please let me get to the finish. No. You aren't getting to the finish to be the team captain because I will be the team captain if I win. Yikes. I'm falling. Stephanie. You better not push us off at the castle wall to be the team captain or else we will start over again. Dang it. I fell off at the castle wall. Now I have to start over again by climbing up the ladder again. Okay Alfred and Sastro, let's climb up the ladder to get onto that castle wall. But, step and walk carefully and don't fall off. Seriously, why do I always have to follow the contestants for the stinky queue? I hate waiting longer. Mal, shut the flip up and you aren't going to rush to the finish. Now look, Zazwiza almost getting close to the finish. She's about to be a team captain if she wins. Now, don't you dare to push me off of the castle wall. Well, how about this, Ival? Mal, what did you just do to Ibel? Shut up Eloise. I'm going to push both of you off too to make me become a team captain. Not so fast you stupid monster, Mal. You can't be a team captain to try to push us off of the castle wall because you pushed Ibel off. So that's what you get. Whoa. Pre, you're a total hero because you resisted Mal from pushing us off of the castle wall. Yep, I know right, Lee. That is what I thought because that would teach Mal not to push us off the castle wall. Oh look! A climb down ladder. Now let's climb down the ladder to see if I win. Hopefully, I will be a team captain. Yes! I made it to the finish. So, I win. Congrats, Zazweezer. You made it to the finish because you have a winner. Also, you're now a team captain. Now we need one more winner before I end the contest. This is all your fault, Mal. You literally pushed me off of the castle wall and made me start over again, especially you. Why don't you go kill yourself, stubborn jackhead? Don't ever try to argue with me. Just start over again already or else you will be timed out for 2,763 seconds. Do you get it already? Ugh. You know what, Ibel? Fine. I will start over again by climbing up the ladder again. You see about that. Well, before I start over again, I need to wait for 30 seconds and calm myself down because I don't want to follow Mal ever again. Ugh. You have gotta be kidding me right now. Queue up again already? That's just maliciously outrageous. I'm about to lose my patience if I let us pass the finish by pushing us off. 
No, please. Don't push me off the castle wall to make me start over. Trust me. Don't worry, Derek. I trust you anyways because I won't push you off. Finally, at last. I just saw the climb down ladder. But, Zazweza won the first contest. Now let's climb down the ladder to see if I can win and become a second team captain. Whoa. Sashtaro, you have reached the finish because you're a second team captain. Also, the contest is officially over. So, that means Zazweza and Sashtaro can pick the teams. Alright, now we can finally pick the contestants for our teams because we are team captains. But first, you need to wait for the next episode. What? Next episode? Why? Yep, you heard Fanastasia correctly. Both of you need to wait for the next episode because you can find out after the next episode comes out. Oh, okay. We'll take it for the next episode if we can find out next time. Okay, that will be the end of this episode. Zazwizu and Sashtaro are going to pick the contestants on their teams. Anyway, this is Magic Dust the host and Fanastasia the co-host, signing off. See you in the Awesomeness Elimination Series Episode 2.